today is about the bike installation for my kid and um, yeah I know this is a filmmaking channel but if you got kids you got to you got to do something for them too so um, for those of you who have kids let's let's look at your possible gift for them and um, if this is what you're choosing you might want to learn how to install it so you're welcome and it's the Royal Baby Galaxy Kids bike the 16 inch version basically for ages uh, 3 to 9 years old I particularly wanted this because it has this um, extra wheel I know my son is daring he likes to take risks so I want to limit the risks I had to get this one that can have the like the third wheels for balancing uh, if you are using the the extra wheels like I am you won't be needing this device this is to give support and get the um, bike standing um, at some point so we are not gonna need this let's put it aside all right here are the parts the the item comes pretty much uh, almost ready it's half ready so it's not it's not a difficult installation okay um, the only things that I have already taken off are the um, some disc that were there you will see on the disc reading uh, take off they are just for packaging so when you take off those stuff this is what is left so first of all let's install the wheels I mean the extra wheels for support or balancing um, get them tight in there And you know, after hand, you still need to all the device, all the um, tools that you will need. Uh, they all come in the in the package. So um, I already put on the other other feet to save time. Just the same way I did this front one. Now let, next, you would need to take off this cap. It's not needed. And then um, mount the the um, top handle the bike handle like this push it in and there is a screw on top you have to take off this um, wrap and you will see the screw and get your hand get your tool your allen tool then you will see the particular You'll find, you will be able to find the actual one that fits and yeah this is the one and you tighten and tighten you need to hold the wheel to get a good grip so next yeah, you want to get the seat in place same thing you you know push that in and according to the height you desire you lock it in place it's got a hard lock you know locking system now let's go back to tightening our um, extra wheels this is one of the tools provided in both sides now for the feet uh, it's labeled left and right so you take note of uh, the right to put the right ones um, the left one you talk, turn it anti-clockwise to fit in and the right one when you put in it you turn it clockwise and then of course you will need to lock it up in place so I've already gone ahead to put the right one in to save time. 
and next we have to put the um, bell this is the horn so um, you're losing it at first to install it you're losing out the screw and uh, you'll be able to you know put that into place you press hard to make it fall in place and lock in place put it in the desired position and then screw the nut the nut in in place pretty good price you know affordable price not bad for um, i mean quality product like this i'm especially exci excited for the extra fit because i didn't want to get my son a bicycle to start with till i see some till i see that he's getting more responsible because uh, uh he's too adventurous so uh, when i saw this extra fit i said okay this is this one i i wouldn't even have to be there for him to learn so he could learn how to drive and you know if i'm not there I, I don't have to worry so that's why i really love this version okay and the good thing is that when he grows out of it you can take those feet off and put the and put the single one that we kept aside so you want to keep that for future installation all right i've finished uh, tightening the um, bell next you want to put the back reflector you know that kind of uh, gives notice that you know hey i'm here especially when you're riding at night um yeah you, so you want to install that underneath the seat and, and then screw it in place at the same thing you unscrew to put in place and then you screw back in as desired the front reflector Yeah, we are completed basically. It's over. It's simple and straight. Everything is in place, but I'll need to relocate this um, handle. So I've, I've lifted it up and now I can, you know, take that uh, the reflect front reflector, take it out and put it in the right place, which is, I think is the better position. So your hands, um, the handle can be freer for um, other things if possible if necessary but I think this this is the ideal place for it so you, of course unscrew again and screw in place and we are ready now if you have any issues about the tension uh, of the tires or the wheels or brakes you can adjust as desired move back and forth from the f uh, front and back feet um, it's just a uh, you would try to just uh, you know find it fine tune and figure it out what works for you but the front and the back tires you can adjust as desired and with that we are basically done all right guys thank you guys for watching i hope it helped somebody out um you could go ahead and like subscribe and uh probably see you in the next one bye